Hey, Aiden, how are you? Yes, sir, I am fine. Thanks for asking. What about you? Yes, I'm also good. Thank you. Uh, Aiden, I recently found your uh, resume and it feels quite interesting for the current domain. So, Aiden, uh, okay. I would like to know more about you. So, can you please give a walk around? Yeah, thanks for giving this opportunity for interview. I am so excited uh, to give this interview as a data analyst profession. Mm -hmm. uh, my name is Aryan. Basically, I am from Bihar, Patna, and I have completed my uh, BCom with the uh, BCom with the stream of Bachelor of Commerce from Magad University. And talking about uh, about a skill uh, in data field, like I know. Excel, Power BI, SQL, and Python. And I know library also in Python, like uh, full library I know, like uh, NumPy, Pandas, and Matplot, and Seaborg. And with the help of that skill, I make a lot of project with the help of that skill. Uh, real life project I made. And that's it, sir. That's it. Well, well, well. So, uh, where you were acquainted uh, with the projects, so what all challenges did you face, Aryan? Yeah, talking about challenges means I faced uh, while making the cleaning part. Like it's just so complex for me. Mm -hmm. Like I, uh, when it comes to remove the null value, uh, duplicate value, like mm -hmm. I face a lot of problem in cleaning part. That is so complex stuff for me. Okay. Yeah, and uh, talking about SQL, uh, that is the power BI I face in clean part. But uh, talking about SQL challenge, I face uh, in uh, uh, like a sub query. Like that is also complex. Like I uh, when I write a query in SQL, that is so confusing in sub query. But I instead of sub query, I use CT. Uh, that is common table expression I use instead of sub query. Well, that things I feel. Uh, so, Adian, I would like to know what are your strengths? Uh, talking about strength, I am a type of person. I you, uh, I can learn quickly anything. Like uh, you know, sir, in data field, there are lots of technology come, new technology come. Then I can easily adopt there. I can easily learn there, like with the help of data strength. Like you can say, like data strength uh, help me a lot in data field. Like in data analyst role. Okay. okay. So, uh, Aryan, if I would like to add, uh, if there is a requirement on testing part or some other tools, let's say uh, there is a new tool which has come to the market and uh, mm -hmm. you need to grasp that tool as soon as possible and you have to work on that. So, how comfortable are you with that? Yeah, it's okay, but uh, it takes some time. I will work on it. I will learn from the YouTube. That is a, a good platform to learn it. And also I take help. Like nowadays I take mostly help from chat GPT. Uh, that give me uh, accurate answer. Whatever I want, they provide me answer. And I also uh, take help from the Google, YouTube and chat GPT. They are a thief platform. I take help. And I will, I will be, I hope like I will be, uh, after some time I will be, uh learn about that everything's about that particular okay. uh, new technology whatever coming market so uh, yes, okay sir. that's great to hear again and uh, uh, let's say uh, that uh, i have given you a project and uh, that's yes, a large scale project and with a mm -hmm. deadline of you know a shorter period of deadline so how are you going to manage that suppose like short period of time i should work requirement to work hard then mm -hmm. i will uh, i will i will give 100 percent to do that work instead of doing another things i i will focus on only that particular work instead of any another bullshit work i will left everything only focus on that particular work and sometime i will help from the google chat gpt to uh, more efficiency well, uh, I will take help from that tools that I will. So do. don't you think that getting a large scale project and handling of your own would uh, uh, mean disturb your work life balance? 
uh, sorry sir i didn't get can you repeat i mean uh, giving a, a you know large scale project and uh, you mm -hmm. know handling a large scale project would disturb your work life balance and your you know personal life balance so how are you yeah, but, uh, overcome that yeah uh, i will like i would write everything according mm -hmm. on write uh, i will on short note like I, I will write everything which time i will do that things like uh, i will take sleep proper sleep also exercise also meditation also i will add. and work time is also important like uh, everything i set you uh, on particular task on uh, write the uh, write in a copy on the basis of that things i will sort out sir i will manage everything sir i will not disturb from any particular things i will manage everything on the basis of whatever i write on copy i will well, separate it i distribute everything fine fine so uh, well uh, arjun uh, let's uh, jump into the tech uh, mm -hmm. part okay so okay. Uh, coming to the uh, sql part okay how proficient are you in sql uh, i will give my rating myself like you can say 7 out of 10 7 out of 10 all right so my first question goes uh arjun uh, just tell me how will you handle null values in sql okay sql queries uh, can you please demonstrate uh, how to filter replace uh, or handle null values in sql query mm, like uh, how can i find extract your top yes how will you handle null yeah. values in sql queries yeah i will write the syntax like select all from the table name okay where column name is called to mm -hmm. and after that semicolon and enter if you want you can just uh, write it on the chat box a uh, chat box here yes if it's okay for you you can just write it in the chat box Okay, sir. For better understanding, yeah. Yes, sir. I see. Okay. Fine. I got you. Well, my second question goes is was uh, can you demonstrate how filter and replace uh, works in the SQL query? What's the syntax? Uh, re replace some value from another value. You are talking about, sir. Yeah. In this, in that situation, we are using update value. Update. table name then after that set okay set okay uh column is equal to mm -hmm. whatever i will say whatever i will put that value i will say then after that where uh where a column name is that like uh, i have a uh, i will give a example sir then uh, we yes can... better give with an example yeah. uh, yes suppose uh, there is a roll number there mm -hmm. is a table having to column like uh, one side is a roll number second side is a name but i want to replace my name is aryan like one column name is aryan i want to replace that name with ashish then i will uh, i will say i will write that table name is suppose a student then i will write the query update a student then after that set uh, column name is column name is equal to aryan then after that where uh, where column name is aryan in set place like your set column mm -hmm. name is equal to asis mm -hmm. and where column name is equal to aryan like where whatever i got put you. in where that converted into set got you are you sure on this aryan yes sir i am sure 
Okay. So, uh, Arjun, just uh, explain me the process of creating an index in SQL and uh, would you create an index uh, 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 and what are the, some factors to consider when designing index for a database? Uh, sorry, sir, I don't know. But I know that theoretical part, but I don't know. Okay, what is the process of creating an index in SQL? Any idea? Uh, no, sir, I don't know. Okay. Uh, what is a subquery in SQL? A subquery, like uh, you can say, with the help of subquery, we can easily get the result. Like uh, we can distribute the uh, query into subquery for okay. easily write the. You can say like subquery is a type of temporary something. Make a temporary, then after that we can extract the data from temporary to get mm -hmm. the final result to get the output. Well, and uh, but hmm. most of time I use CTEC, CTE okay. common yes. table expression yes. instead of right. uh, subquery because Done. we are easily get it. Well, Aryan, uh, what do you understand by uh, stored procedures? A stored procedure. Mm -hmm. uh, sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. It's a new okay. 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 No worries. Okay. Uh, can you tell me what is primary key? And why it is important in SQL? A primary key, it means like a column have unique value with none, uh, with not not none. Uh, that is the primary key. You can say like why this is requirement in every table. Okay. With the help of that, we can identify the distinct row. Okay. That is the. You can say like that is the unique value they provide. Okay. There is no matching to another row in a table. So, uh, Aryan, uh, then what is, you know, how would you perform data aggregation in SQL? Data aggregation. Like, uh, yes. there are lots of aggregation, uh, like mm -hmm. uh, meet, sum, max, count, or uh, that is the, like uh, we can use in a SQL query, like select. Uh, count, uh, select count, aggregate gate function like select count and column name from the column table. Sure on that. And mostly we uh, we mostly we use in a aggregate function in group uh, group by. Okay. Okay. Done. Uh, let's jump into the next part. Uh, it's Excel. Okay. I'll be asking some couple of questions from Excel as well. Okay. Okay. So, uh, what do you understand by the difference between a uh, line chart and scatter plot? Scatter. scatter plot and line chart. Sir, I know in visual format, but I don't know exactly what's uh, different between. Okay, difference. Between. Sorry, sir. Fine. Uh, how would you create a data validation drop down list in Excel? data validation yes so any idea okay i don't know okay uh i can just let me know what is the purpose of index and match functions and how are they used together uh, so any idea okay fine not an issue okay so how how are you going to rate yourself uh on the scale of 10 for power bi Probably uh, six out of three. Six out of three. Okay. So uh, let's say uh, I want to create uh, columns and uh, measure in Power BI desktop. How would I do that? Like uh, I want to create calculated columns and, and measures in Power BI desktop. So how would I? How would I do that? Like. Uh, in data side, like the, there is a right side data panel is showing, mm -hmm. then we can click on any particular data, means okay. table. Then after that, click on right button, then we can easily see new measure. And after that, we can okay. click on new measure, then on, then first click on new measure, then like I would write the data function. Mm -hmm. And after that, we can click on column, then we can add the column. 
active. Okay. Yes, uh, Aryan. So, uh, fine. Uh, next question is uh, explain the concept of role level security in Power BI. A role level security. Yes. Role level secure security. Any idea? Uh, sorry. No, sorry. Okay. Uh, any any difference between Power BI and uh, Power BI desktop and Power BI service? Do you know any difference? Yes, yeah, sir. We can in Power BI service and Power BI test, uh, dashboard. Desktop. Yes. Like uh, in Power BI dashboard, we can create the. No, no, no. Like Power BI desktop. Yes. Huh. Uh, we can create the vis visual format. We can uh, create the measure. Okay. We can manage the table. Okay. And whatever we made the project. Mm -hmm. We will publish in a Power BI service to the people, to the HR, to the any any people. We can share easily with the help of Power BI service. Okay. That is the difference. We made we make the project with the help of Power BI dashboard. We share the project with the help of Power BI service. That's it. that is the difference. Okay, Aryan. Let's say I have a requirement to create a calculated table in Power BI. How would I do that? calculated table and power bi what's the question? sorry uh, what's the question sir can you repeat again yes uh, i have a requirement that i have i need to create a calculated table in power bi so how would i do that which it column your table calculated table yes sorry sir. okay know. fine uh, can you explain me the purpose of Power BI gateways and uh, when would you use it them? Any idea? Uh, no idea, sir. Fine. Not an issue, Aryan. Uh, so I'm done from my end. Okay. No worries. Okay. okay. So I'll get a bit the feedback. Okay. Mm -hmm. And uh, we'll let you know very soon. All right. Okay, sir. Done. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you so much.